Hello, this is Norma and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to clean your Asanka bowl. It's a traditional bowl. This came from Ghana and if you buy it, it's clay. You cannot just take it, wash it and eat in it because it has a lot of soot in there. It has a lot of sand. So I'm going to show you how to clean it before you use it the first time. So the first thing I do, I have some water right here. Just tap water. I'm gonna wash. I'm gonna wash all around the bowl. I've wasted the water and rinse it out. Now make sure you get a grinder to go with it. And I'm gonna take my coarse kosher salt. This is the coarse kosher salt and I'm just going to sprinkle it all in it. And now I'm going to take my grinder and ground it. And by doing this, you're trying to get all the sand out. If you look in there, you can see it's starting to get brown. So I'm just going to scrape it all around. And I will be back when it's time to waste this one and put a new one in there to clean it. The goal is to get it clear where the salt is not brown with all the sand in there. So let me keep grinding and I will be back. This is the first one and when you put the water in there you will see how dirty it is and you will see all the sand and make sure when you grind it you grind it around here also because this is like a local blender so when you blend you want to make sure everything in here is clean. See the water? I'm gonna waste it and I'll be back. This is the second one. You see, you still can see a lot of the sand and the soup that's in there. So I'm going to keep wasting it and cleaning it. And when it's completely clear, I will be back. Okay, this is the last time that I'm doing it. This is the eighth time. And you're trying to make your food clean. It's my oven that's going because when I'm done, I'm going to bake it. So I'm sorry, my oven is just setting. I put it on the lowest, which was 175. put the water so you can see how clay it is and now your asanka is clean I'm gonna run it over my tap water and dry it off with my hand towel and I'm gonna put it in my oven and this is the first time that you have to do this step after you don't have to so I put it in my oven so the clay can dry 
and then when I take it out I'll be ready to use it this is the first time I clean my Asanka before I use it if you have a different way just drop it in the comment box and let me find out how you clean yours thank you for watching please subscribe to my channel hit that notification button so each time I upload you will be notified bye bye